So what does it all mean to have 7 billion people on the planet? Just back in the 1960s, there were only 3 billion. What does that say about the rest of us or mean for the rest of us? Well, we recently met a pair of twins who hit the landmark age 100, and we want them to share their secrets. My name is Inez. My name is Denise. And we're twin sisters. I was born January 15, 1911. My sister was born 15 minutes later. I'm the baby of the family. She's always bragged about it. I enjoyed every bit. We have been inseparable our whole lives. We were always very close and had the same friends. A lot of them couldn't tell us apart. My first husband passed away in 1961. I remarried a man that was a few years younger than I was. I guess that makes me a cougar. You can play that one. Watch out for your mom. She's the shark. Bonnie is my only daughter. I have four grandchildren and four great-grandchildren. I've been married three times. Both my boys each have three girls, and I have 18 great-grandchildren. A lot of people don't believe that we're 100 years old because we're very active. I go to an exercise class once a week. We do this and up and down. Keeping your mind active and being with friends and being happy. I think it's a very important part of your life. Well, we are very blessed to have Anise and Venice here with us. Thank you, ladies, for joining us. Well, you, you have some secrets, and I hear you think diet played a big role. I think living a good, healthy life from diet has a little bit to do with it, but I think your mind and controlling your ideas and everything has a lot to do with your living, and your living your home family conditions are, make a difference, too. We've always been very close. And you have a, a companion for life next to you. We've never had any, we've never, I can never remember of us ever having any fight that was amounted to anything. That is amazing. It really is. I have to say, I was reading your story last night, and you guys were talking about how sleep is so important to you, and exercise, you've always yes. been active, even when you were young, and how you learned to cook during the Great Depression and make food healthy for next to nothing. And you are the living, breathing example of everything that we talk about, and you're just in incredible shape at 100 years old. Do you have anything in particular, Venice, that you think is the secret to being we, vital? We just lived uh, a happy life. We were raised on a citrus ranch most of our life, and uh, I, uh, I think that is part of the reason that we have stayed so healthy. I think having a positive attitude has a lot to do with your health and your whole life, your happiness and, and everything you do. Well, we cannot thank you enough for sharing your story with us.